Hi you guys, so I decided that I wanted to do a breast cancer look. So this is the look that I came up with. If you guys would like to see the, how I got this look, please do stay tuned and I will show you. And also, um, yes, um, I told you guys on my vlog that I'm in kinda gonna not be doing videos and stuff, but also I told you guys for like October, um, I'm just gonna kind of finish it out and this is one of the things that I wanted to kind of finish out for October was a breast cancer look and I'm gonna also do um, favorites for this month and just kind of finish out the year of favorites but you know just to kind of update you guys and let you guys know that but once again thank you guys so much for watching um commenting and subscribing and thank you guys so much for um your support i really do appreciate it but if you guys would like to see how i got slipped do stay tuned and i will show you so first i'm going to start off with my myx depotted purple jumbo pencil and my bh cosmetics mini brush set and the double ended brush it is for eyeliner but I like to use it in my crease sometime I kind of use this brush for everything and I'm just gonna go in my crease and create a wing a little bit of a wing not a drastic wing so now I am going to take my wet n wild pencil in the color purple violet and just go right on top of where I created that wing and just basically define it a little bit more and create um, even more of a wing, make it more defined. So now I'm going to take my Sonia Kashuk brush. This pointed brush is perfect for like everything that like my tear duct. But I'm going to use it in my crease. And we're going to go into the Wet n Wild Vice palette. The Venice Beach palettes that they had. And the High Flying Colors palette. I'm pretty much going to use this during the whole tutorial. And take that dark purple at the bottom. And just go and define that purple even more. So now I'm going to go back into the palette and take that blue right next to that purple and take one of the BH Cosmetics brushes and it's like a small little pointed brush as well and go right on top of that purple and just to give it some definition, put that on top. So now I'm going to take my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and go on to that really pretty dark pink at the top and just put it all over my lid from wherever the purple is not basically. <laughs> So now I'm going to take my Becca Shimmering Powder and Rose Gold and just basically use it as my brow highlight. So now I'm going to take my Wet n Wild pencil in the color Turquoise and go all over my waterline. So 
So now I'm going to go into my Naked 2 palette and take the colors Booty Call and Half Baked and go into my Tear Duct and apply them. So now I'm going to take that same brush that I used to define my crease and go back into my palette and take that pretty, a little bit darker than sky blue color and smudge right under my waterline. So now I'm just going to apply some blue mascara from LA Colors. So now I'm going to apply my liner and my lashes are number 43 and I'll be right back. So now I'm going to take my blush brush and my blush which is from MAC which is Love Rush and apply it to up my cheeks and work it back towards my ear. So now I'm going to take my highlight, which is MAC Gold Deposit, and apply it to the normal places I always apply it to, which is the top of my cheek above my blush, and my nose, my chin, my cupid's bow right above my brow, and my forehead. So now I'm going to take the pen, lip pencil in the color Night Moth by MAC and just outline my lips. So to create like a little bit of an ombre look, I'm going to use Heroin Matte by MAC and it's this really pretty purple color and just basically finesse my lips until I get the look that I want. So now I'm going to take the NYX Intense Butter Gloss in the color Berry Strudel and just add a pop, a dab of that to the center of my lips just for a little pop of light. So that is pretty much it you guys, that is it for this tutorial. 
Thank you guys so much for taking the time to watch.